Oops, I want to do Hades. Hey, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Welch, back at it again with another crappy film. This time, it's a documentary. I know, right? How exciting. I can't explain to you how excited I am for this because I'm literally not excited at all. It's a documentary about the Budge Boys, the boys of Budge, and the Budge that I live at, Budge Hall. Uh, I don't know why I'm making this. I just want to find out what it means to be a Budge Boy. So, uh, you know, I hope my quest for knowledge doesn't take me anywhere too dark. And that's all. I heard that a guy down the hall likes to walk around campus at night. He calls it lurking. I don't know about lurking, but I've been lost in the woods like 47 times now. So this should be a piece of the cake walk for me. It's kind of like a long walk around campus, going like weird places you don't sort of see every day. Just sort of exploring, you know? But like at night, so no one's there, so you don't look too weird. I've agreed to this endeavor knowing full well that my life may be at risk. I've come to terms with my possible fate. Sometimes you just gotta set your salt circle and hope that the Shogoths don't take your entrails. This man is a master of the lurk. He saunters through the night like a clandestine jellyfish. He's stealthy as a stealth bowling ball. He's swift like a well-placed torrent of ketchup on a 4th of July hamburger. He's enigmatic like a burrito filled with peanut butter. Okay, this is getting weird. Who wrote this? I think it was Michael. Weird, weird script. It's really weird. It was Michael. It's a really nice evening. Well lit. Oddly well lit though. Like I've seen Rodney around here a few times, just like when I'm out, but he just sort of stared at me for a bit and just, huh. he just walked off. I mean, but I never talked to him, like, in the dorms. Kai's mention of this Rodney character has me spooked. I guess I'll have to look into it later. Things were nearly just fine until we encountered the police. Yeah, so there's a police car right over there. I can't be looking too suspicious, you know, I got my head down, I'm trying to... I mean, I'm already suspicious, I'm just yeah. really walking around at 2 a.m. in a place where no one else is. Who's there? FBI, open up! We never made it back alive. That's it. We died. At some point during editing, I realized that I was a hopeless idiot and I needed help. I also realized that I was taking way too long to make this thing, so... The rest of it will just be thrown together pretty crappily. Enjoy. Come, friend. Consume coinage with me. Come, friend. Consume spoons with me. After losing it for a while, I decided to go talk to my friend Colin, because he always knows what to do. Don't actually film me shaving, because I feel like someone's going to come out like, You have terrible form! <laughs> <laughs> it's just all about balance, you know? Same with like growing a beard out or doing anything, any scruff. It's all about balance. Not screwing things up. That's how life is. There's the good days, there's the bad. Today I laid in bed till four-ish. And then I went to two of my classes and I skipped two others because I just didn't feel good. And I had a lot go on, but live and learn, you know? Live, live and learn. There you go. Just like B-roll footage. There's kind of friends like you hang out by yourself and with another person and people you hang out with other people and some of those people are kind of like Harrison and Will sometimes. Um, try to hang out with Harrison a lot by myself and sometimes Will. 
um, Ander, Rodney. Um, I keep hearing people say uh, Rodney. Like, I've never seen him. Who is he? Do you know? <laughs> um, uh, it's kind of embarrassing. I, 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 I think he's Ander's roommate. I don't have a roommate. My roommate left me. I was too smelly. He was too smelly. Sometimes when I'm alone, I just lay on the ground and fart. <laughs> and no one's there to judge me, so when nature takes its course, a bit of frosting, I'm taking that course. A full course meal. Six pounds of milk is what I'm talking about. <laughs> I drink milk. <laughs> I'm gonna try as hard as I can to make you uncomfortable. Okay, okay. okay tonight I have a nice Milky Way fun sized bar. I want you to like put me in a different place. Okay. Story. I'm gonna put you in a different place. I want you to make me feel as uncomfortable as possible. Okay. The night is chilly and moonlit. There is there are trick or treaters everywhere milling about. They have costumes of various degrees of quality. I'm one of them. I'm wearing a yellow, a gray jumpsuit with yellow tape on it. Are you cute? Which makes you really uncomfortable. Oh, yeah, it's one of the pilots, too. Yeah, one of them holds over to me a orange pumpkin basket, mm -hmm. and it's got a little face in it. It's tr a triangle eyes and triangle nose and jagged mouth. It looks like a, a jack-o'-lantern, in fact. And I reach inside. My hand scrapes the edge on the way in. I feel slightly disturbed. I pull it out with ever so much gentle gentility. And then I place it in my own pillowcase. I drop it. This is what it sounds like. That's the sound that pervaded my ears when I placed it into my pillowcase. It consists of a chocolatey outside uh -huh. <laughs> and nougat and caramel in the center. Yeah. It tastes fluffy like a cloud or a nebula. Maybe that's why they call it Milky Way. I'm about a third of the way through it. Here we go. Yeah, I don't know why I put that in there. I must hate my audience. But uh, anyway, we did a Super Smash Bros. tournament as well. So here's a highlight reel of that. No! 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 Are you good? I have the thickest of this. This is why we, 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 we never practice. practice. He's gonna curb you! Yeah. Oh, 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 Well, there you have it, folks. The results of the Smash Championship. Uh, Aaron is the reigning champ, uh, with Will as runner-up, and Gustavo. Gustavo is Gustavo. Gustavo is third place. But it wasn't official. Steaming pasta, flowing sauces, endless breadsticks and decadent cheeses, Caesar salad, hide and the trees, Costco noodles waving in the breeze, country road, take me home to the place. I belong, all I've got in bargain market, take me home, country.
she rose. Sometimes I hear her in the morning hour she, she calls me back to that crappy Italian food that I love. Spaghetti sauce that...